here at the Forukina 2016 at the Manfrotto booth with uh, Nick. Hello, Nick. Hi, everybody. And uh, what we are going to see now is the new bags from Manfrotto. So, uh, Nick, can uh, you show us some of the new bags? Yes, of course. Um, the first new products we are we have here uh, is our new Pro Light three and one backpacks. And there are two models, as you can see. The smaller one is three and one twenty six, and then the bigger one is three and one thirty six. And there are lots of new upgrade and improvement. I mean, from the previous model. Um, just give you a bit of background. Three and one means that there are three different ways to carry the bag, and uh, we just add another new definition of three and one. I mean, uh, the big one can actually carry three different kind of equipment, and I'm going to show you guys how it can be carried in three different way. So, as you can see, it's a very specially designed harness system. Uh, the first way is I can use it as a normal backpack. The sh two shoulders is, uh, shoulder straps are here and then it can be used as a normal backpack. The second one is if I really want to do a uh, quick and uh, easy access, what I can do is I detach the two straps like this and then I attach the strap to the other side of the bag. Okay. And then I just quickly go through this one and it becomes a sling bag. When it is a sling bag, I can just turn here and then open like this. I can start shooting already. So it's so quickly and then you can change your lenses and then you can take out your camera and so on. But we all know with one shoulder only, to carry the bag, it will be a bit tiring. So that's why, I mean, I can just reach for my other strap and then I get it here and then I tighten it. I put it all the way here. It becomes a cross backpack. So in this uh, cross backpack section, uh, in the configuration, I can do both uh, the quickness and also the stability as well. So uh, it's a very, very, I mean, uh, comfortable to use. Apart from the harness system, there are also, of course, other type of uh, improvement we do for the backpack. Like, for example, uh, we improve also the tripod connection um, uh, here. So basically what we can do is uh, we just we don't need to uh, get any external connection way. We just uh, open the tripod like this. We slide the legs in. So it basically sit here tightly. But how about the, the legs outside? I mean, if it's open like that, what we we do? We just uh, open a tuck away pocket, and then you will find there are two webbing straps here, and then I just do uh, closing like this. Okay, and then it becoming tidily tied up like this one. So nothing is removable. You will not lose your tripod cup. You will not lose your webbing strap. So it's so easy. The small one can fit the DSR camera with five lenses. You can also fit a Canon EOS C100 after you remove the top handle and side handle or inside the bag. The big one can carry all the stuff the 26 can carry but also you can carry a drone inside the bag and with other of also DSLR and lenses. So these are the new 3-in-1 bags. Mm. So uh, let's see uh, some of the other things that you have here. Yes, of course. I'm going to show you guys also the new roller. we actually been using a roller from Manfrotto to walk through the show until now. So this is a new model. Exactly. Yes. And uh, so this is our new uh, model of roller called Reloader 55. Okay, um, is a ProLite product, and as you can see from outside, we are using our ProLite fabric. Like uh, we are using the Manfrotto ripstop fabric, which is uh, very, very durable, and water repellent, and so on. So um, this size is an international carry-on size. So you can uh, mean carry your luggage together with you on the plane and put it into your, the overhead compartment. And, we do a lot of uh, improvement externally, like uh, we add protection on the bottom so that it can resist uh, scratch and so on. And also we add a lot of uh, corner protection. Do you see that the wheels or the protection for the wheels is also different? Uh, yes, we are using a new type of wheels. Um, this wheel can be replaceable as well. We are using a roller blade type, it's an 84mm size, so you can uh, sw swap it if you like. And it is compatible to other roller blade type wheels in the market as well. Mm -hmm. So, and another good features of the bag is when you are uh, like catching a flight quickly, you can just open the main zipper, uh, the front zipper, 
and you can access your laptop and your uh, tablet without opening the main bag. So it becomes so easy. It's also protected, I think, in terms of, uh, yeah, it's, it has a lot of padding inside. Right, I mean, uh, this is fully padded. I mean, uh, some of the other bags in the market, they might give you uh, just a sleeve that you can slide in your laptop, but it won't be protected in this case. So, may, uh, if I open the bag, you will see also uh, other new features that we're doing. First of all, after you open the bag like this, you see the front flap will stand like this. The reason why is a working tool, so that you can get your gears out here, and you can at the same time get your accessory and all the other things uh, from here. The internal compartment is fully customizable. So it can fit basically a 400mm 2.8 lens attached to a body, with also a backup body with two other lenses. And uh, the funny part, or, and it's also one of our key um, advantages, the bags are long enough to fit in a Manfrotto nano stand so that you can bring two stands, two lights, the cameras together. So it will be really good for solo shooter. So in this case, this is a C100 or 300? Yes, uh, we put the three, uh, C300 here just to show that how big it can carry. Yeah, exactly. And below you can see all the lenses that you can actually fit. Maybe you can uh, uh, put this uh, in a vertical position so you can see the entire uh, compartment. No problem. So basically all the, divider, uh, the dividers are cut, uh, customizable and uh, if I may show you here, this is the signature Manfrotto camera protection system, we call it CPS uh, divider. Uh, as you can see, it's a 3D shaped uh, ripple-like I mean, uh, design, so it absorbs quite a lot of shock and it protects the lens and gear very, very well. Yeah. So, it also comes with a rain cover, so if it is uh, raining heavily, you can cover the whole bag. The wheels will be still usable in that case, so it will be so easy to go through a t t tough uh, weather condition. Okay, uh, can you put this uh, maybe the other way around, just so that the camera can actually see this? So, as you can see, this is the default the divider arrangement, but everything can be customizable if you want. So it's all by Velcro connection. And uh, we provide more than enough dividers for people who, uh, who want to arrange the bag in, uh, based on their need on, for the day. What in terms of a tripod? Can you put the tripod maybe on the side? or? Oh, uh, You are right. I mean, uh, in this case, right now, we, we provide a uh, side pocket that you can slide your tripod in and then you can uh, just add the two uh, weapon strap here and then you can put the tripod on the side. Uh, the good thing of this one is after installing the tripod, you won't have an issue of opening a bag like this because uh, the tripod will be sitting on, uh, on here in this position so that the flap will be fully uh, I mean, uh, flexible to be open like this. Yeah. Okay, and of course, uh, if you have a small tripod, you can probably put it inside as well. Yes, you're right. I mean, uh, like our B3 um, tripod or uh, Jitsu Traveler tripod, it can be put inside the bag. Yeah. Okay, so uh, what else? This is uh, the second, this is a um, roller bag. You have, uh, I think, a few other bags uh, to show? Right. Um, the last collection I would like to show you is our Manfrotto Windsor collection. Um, these two bags are from our Manfrotto Windsor, Windsor collection. And uh, Manfrotto Windsor collection is our new lifestyle collection. Um, there are four different SKU. I'm showing you these two because they are our representative model. So, um, Windsor collection, the design language is inspired by British uh, classic look. As you can see from the top fabric, there are I mean, the Helen Brom type of fabric, like the traditional coat and jacket I mean, uh, that they are using. And uh, we are using real leather trim and also metal uh, accessory here and there with Manfrotto logo uh, here as well. So basically, uh, it can be used for your photo shooting of the day. At the same time, when you are going for work, you're going for school, you can also bring this back with you. There's no issue with that. So um, for the backpack, basically it's a side access. And if you open like that, there's a pouch inside. And you, why this is designed like this? You can, of course, I mean, just close the flap like this, and then you have your gear here. It will be so easy for you to get your gears outside from here. Okay. Uh, but if you don't, if you are not going to shoot on that day, you can just close the uh, flap of the pouch. You take out the pouch, and then you can use the bag as a normal day pack. Okay.
Um, you might see also the lining inside is a uh, really, really nice design. And uh, the design language is, uh, I mean, uh, very aligned to the British, I mean, traditional feeling. Yes. Okay, uh, for on the backpack, you have also the possibility to attach a tripod in front. So a small tripod, a foldable one maybe, uh, horizontally. Yeah. And there are numerous uh, pockets everywhere, so for you to organize your things. How does the upper part co compartment look? Okay, when you open the upper part compartment, okay, there's uh, I mean, compartment for, for you to put some personal stuff. So uh, it will be really good for your day trip that you can pack your lunch here, your jacket here. I mean, everything can be stuck here. Inside, you will also find a small uh, I, uh, laptop sleeve that you can put your 13-inch laptop inside. So it will become a very, very good day pack as well as uh, your photo bag as well. Okay, and we have the smaller one as well. Right. So the smaller one will be uh, very good for people who are actually wearing suit or formal dressing. Because it's a messenger bag, it's very small. It open, uh, fully open like this, okay? As you can see, uh, inside you have the dividers for you to put your compact system camera, like Sony Alpha 7 or Fujifilm X-T series, with uh, two to three lenses. On the back side, you will find a space for you to put in your, I mean, a 10-inch tablet. And uh, there are lots of internal pockets and external pockets for you to organize uh, your stuff. At the same time, if you don't want to fully open the bag, you just want to put it like this, and then you want to get the gear, you have a top zipper here like this, you open it, and then you can access your stuff, I mean, uh, from here. Um, our designers are very detailed mind, as you can see, even though here there's a zipper, so they especially add one layer of uh, lining here, in order to protect the screen of the camera not to be scratched in this case. The design language is uh, aligned to the backpack as well. So, I mean, uh, this is our new Windsor and Photo Windsor collection. And uh, I hope you guys like it. Thank you very much. Thank you.